Hello and welcome to ASEAN Talent, the show that will present you the stories of all talented people around the region. And today, have a good opportunity to talk with a young talented singer in Thailand. She is a very pretty little girl who won five medals in the World Championships of Performing Arts in the United States. I am now standing at her house. Now, let's see her. Hi, how are you? And this is the girl that we will be talking about her stories, Kunan Safida. Safida from Pirina, Thailand. Can I apply into this competition? The answer is that this competition only accepts people who are representative of their country. And I am now sitting with Kun Satida from Piria or Kun Nan, who just won the competition from five categories. Now let's talk about her competition. So Kun Nan, สวัสดีครับสวัสดีค่ะ Let's talk about the prizes that you won from the from this competition. Well, this competition is the WCOPA World Championships of Performing Arts, and I um, I go for the vocal competition only, and I go in five category, which is opera. Pop, Broadway musical, mm -hmm. R&B, so jazz, and then the last one is world music. And then, luckily, I won the gold and overall. Actually, how many categories that the participant can apply for? For singing, there is 14. Like they have gospel, they have country, they have mm -hmm. rock, and many more. So, I see. but maximum is only five for one competitor. And you won all of. Five categories. Luckily, right. The medal prize. Um, the medal, the gold medal, mm -hmm. and another one is overall prize. They call overall winner. And what is the name of this competition? World Championships of Performing Arts. It is the global level. Ah uh, yes, international, global. Level. World Championships of Performing Arts, or WCOPA, is the official World Talent Championships. Each year, countries send their best and most outstanding talent to the United States. Over the course of a heated week of events, these competitors go head-to-head, -head Olympic style, in a wide variety of competitions. In each category, there will be a fierce contest of skills to see who is truly the most accomplished in the world. Each winner gets a coveted gold medal, which brings with it the respect and admiration of the people around the world, along with potentially a career opportunity of a lifetime. The incredible strength of national pride pushes each and every one of these competitors to give their best, and the result is a must-see event. Kunan, how did you find this competition? I was, it's very lucky thing to do because I was very um, in to searching YouTube and find some good songs or good singer to study. Mm -hmm. And then one day, accidentally, I found a guy. His name is Jet Madela. I was shocked when I see him sing. He sing so perfect. So I was like, oh, who is this guy? And then I searched his name in Wikipedia. And then I found that he is a Filipino who won the grand champion and the five gold medal from WCOPA. So I thought, oh, what is that? Then I searched again in Wikipedia and then I find the information about this competition. And how did you apply for? Well, I was so excited. Then I write a letter to this organization. I ask them that I am a Thai people who, who want to um, try to find a venue, find a place that I can improve myself and go for it. So can I apply it into this competition? The answer is that this competition only accept people who are representative of their country. Um, I have to go through the selection in your national director in your country. So I asked, like, what is the, the national director? They say it's 
it is an organization who select people, who qualified people to enter this competition. Mm -hmm. And at that time, Thailand don't have such an organization. So I asked them whether Thai people have, have had entered this competition before or not. And they say that in 2004, they used to have a Thai people. A group of them, like many of them, attend. But there are Thai people who live in LA, so it's the, it's the place where competition takes place, so they know about it. I tried to find the, the, I mean, the chief, the, the people who sent Thai, those Thai people in that year, but I cannot find them. So I sent a letter to WCOPA, many of letters again and again, until 2010, last year. I write to them, and I, um, I mean, I describe more about myself. I tell them that I won Thailand singing competition in 2006, and does that mean I should be like enough? Is that enough to represent Thailand? And they say that okay, we have to decide. We have to think about that. And they sent my story to the international selection committee, and they asked me to send my profile and and performing video for them to, to decide whether I should be qualified or not. How did you feel when you like, know that you are qualified to attend this competition? It's very funny. It's, I know it about the last Christmas and I was so happy. I, I called my mom and I told my husband I'm so happy and scared at the, at the same time. Why? Why were you scared? <laughs> Because like, oh, is this real? So, did I made it to the competition? And wow, how much preparation do I have to do before I go? Luckily, I don't feel any pressure because I think that what it should be done, I done it already. What about for um, sinking section? Well, I have to tell you, during that competition, I don't have an, much time to see other people. I, um, I have to sing five category in uh, about four hours. So I have to sing, and then I run out, and I um, do the makeup and change the dress, and then go back. But there are a lot of them, I think. Was there any pressure when you like, were on stage as a representative from Thailand? I actually have a lot of pressure when I prepared here in Thailand because I have been in competition three times in my life. First and second time I sing as Satida from Piriya, but this time I sing as Satida from Piriya from Thailand. So I was so scared that I, I scared that I cannot deliver or do what I practice. So I practice so hard, so very hard eight to ten hour a day wow. for each song about five thousand times at least so it's very it's really a lot of practicing and then when I go to America I feel sick in my stomach because my stress and then in the competition day it's I don't know what happened but luckily I don't feel any pressure because I think that what it should be done, i done it already. I will not regret what I'm doing. <laughs> and I have to tell you more. Um, to practice for this competition is not about singing. It's about mental and about the physical. So my husband, he used to be a very sport man. So he supported me in exercising. He took me out and run. And he controlled my blood sugar. <laughs>